Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to get Homebrew Launcher onto your own Wii U. So, you don't want to have like Me Maker as Homebrew Launcher or don't want to use the internet browser to launch it, you can just use this. So, first launch Me Maker or the web browser, whatever you have to open Homebrew. Then download the file. Actually, no. This is actually what you have to do, sorry. I, I meant to. And I'm also going to be installing WUPG installer GX2 in another video. So, here, first, you're going to want to power down your homebrewed Wii U. Make sure it is already ho homebrewed, though. Turn off your Wii U. Look at your Wii U. Open this flap. Make sure you have an SD card inside. Minus four gigabytes. Insert it into your computer. Your computer. After that, for me, it opens up immediately on my computer. And here's everything. Now, now. Let me package up my WP installer GX2 for another video. Okay, it is officially packaged. It has been officially packaged. You're gonna need WinRAR to actually open this though. Here's everything. I'm just uh so you know what? There we go. Now, here's what you need. Uh, I'll put on raw. Just a package. I'm also going to show you, like, packaging my WUP installer GX2 so for the, uh, for next video. So... New WinRAR zip archive. Whoop. WUP installer. GX2. I actually don't know the developers of this, so I'm just gonna be like, uh, I'm gonna search it up and then I'm gonna not, I'm gonna link them and if they have like a GitHub profile or I'm gonna link them if they have like a, a YouTube channel or anything. Like Fix94, for example. Here's WP Installer GX2. Keep that. This one you're going to need to extract to the install folder on your SD card. So, yeah. We're, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make a media fire link for that in the next video. But, what you're going to need is once you download, hold on. Once you have Homebrew Launcher, let me package up Homebrew Launcher too for, next, for this video. Boom. Homebrew Launcher. Oh my god, I spelled it incorrectly. Home. Brew launcher. Homebrew launcher. There you go. Now, now, copy this. My home screen. I should pretend like all of these files don't exist. Goodbye. So, you're going to want to open the homebrew launcher that you have in your folder that you have downloaded. Cl close if your uh, WinRAR has, has expired. Then click on, then drag homebrew launcher to your, uh, to your install folder. Right here. Oh, 
Okay, oh right, hold on. Let me refresh. Boom, it's gone. So this is gone now. Now you wanna have homebrew launcher? No, you can close up everything. And take out your SD card. So you, once you're done, insert it back in. And turn it on. Turn on the gamepad too. This is what it should look like in a short while. Don't worry, this is perfectly normal if you're using Tiramisu. Here it is. Now you're going to want to launch whatever homebrew launcher app you have already. Launch Me Maker. I have it in my unused apps folder since I don't use it anymore. And go to WP Installer and click on Homebrew Launcher, press Install. I'll link the 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 website that uh, for how to hack your Wii U with Tiramisu in the description, like Wii U dot hacks dot by. I'll link it. Now you want to click on NAND. Then like maybe install it on the SD card or on the system memory. And then it says successfully installed. Click OK. And we direct you back to the I think it's gonna redirect you. Yeah, it's gonna redirect you to system to Me Maker. Then click uh, press home and press home again. Should take you to Me Maker. This is pretty annoying, so that's why I'm telling you this guide. Then click, just click home. After that, just click home. Or actually, don't click home. Actually. Click close on New Maker, and after that, you should have the Homebrew Launcher on your home screen, and it works perfectly. Yeah. You're not gonna need the the WP Installer GX2 anymore on the Homebrew. Actually, no. Don't actually don't uninstall it. Yet for our next tutorial. <laughs> now, I have all of this stuff on already. I suggest that I've already homebrewed this thing, so when you want to exit, press home, press close, software, close again. After that, it should be set up. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.